Hey guys, I filmed a shopping vlog while visiting Dallas, Texas last year and I got to visit quite a few different stores and different shopping malls. So today I'm going to be showing you all of those clips. So if you are new to my channel, welcome. Be sure to click on the subscribe button down below and the notification bell in the corner so you're notified every time I upload a new video. Be sure to comment down below your favorite stores to shop at because it was really great to see what was available at all the different places I visited. And this video is a shopper's gift guide so shoppers are able to see the different items at the different places I got to visit. So the first store we'll be taking a look at is Build-A-Bear Workshop. This store seems quite modern and new compared to the ones that I live near, so it'll be interesting to see how different they are. And here we have the front display window. It seems like the most popular item right now is definitely Frozen. The poster at the top is advertising the movie, and then they also have Build-A-Bear's theme to the characters. There's Anna, Elsa, and there's even an Olaf plush too. There are so many different outfits and accessories available that are featured in the movie that makes it so realistic, but these bears down below are the ones that you choose if you want to buy Anna and Elsa, and then you have to stuff them and go through the whole process, but I just realized there's also a Kristoff bear in the top corner with the matching outfit as well. And besides frozen themed Build-A-Bears, there are so many different other character Build-A-Bears as well. There's Pokemon, Paw Patrol, there's Spongebob, and there's even some from the Lion King movie. But of course, if you just want a classic Build-A-Bear, they have so many different options too. This section of the store has some Disney princess themed outfits and accessories. There's some plush toys at the top, but there are also some outfits here. There's Jasmine's outfit, then there's Belle's and Ariel's too. I actually got to visit this store on Halloween night, so that's why they have quite a few different Halloween outfits available, but the most adorable item that I saw was this little candy corn plush. Definitely perfect for the fall season. Over on this section, they have a lot of classic skirt and shirt outfits, and then also dresses too. There's definitely a lot of glitter and sequins, but it seems like the most popular color is purple followed by pink. And here we just have a few more classic Build-A-Bears that are available year-round. So now it's time to leave Build-A-Bear to go visit another store. I'm at the next store now and they have a lot of My Life products available, different outfits and accessories. So we're just taking a look at some of the accessory sets. So there is a bathroom set, a kitchen, and a vanity too. I love all of the smaller accessories that come with these sets because they look so great with any room set up and you can style it however you'd like. From what's available at the store today, they have a wardrobe, a desk, and also a bedroom accessory set. They even have a loft bed right here. You could definitely set up an entire room. This bed over here is really interesting. It's quite small so it's a lot better for a smaller room setup. It has some lovely blankets and throw pillows on it, but you can have it as a single bed, or if you purchase a second bed, you can turn it into a bunk bed. I purchased this living room set a while ago, except it was purple. I think I prefer this style just because it looks a lot more modern and realistic too. And right behind that set, they have some more accessories like horses and doll carriers. These plush accessories look so comfy and cozy, and they're so affordable as well. There are so many different styles to choose from, but I think my favorite one is the one at the front here. Right next to that, they also have some doll shopping carts, and there are some doll starter sets. So these dolls come with accessories as well, based on their personality and their hobbies too. And there's also a vlogger set here too that's definitely on my wish list. And right next to the vlogger set, there is a vending machine. It seems like it's really great sizing because it's not too large, but it's also not an extremely small set as well. This item over here is a dinosaur explorer set, and then they also have a spa set here too. These accessory sets are really great because they're at a really affordable price, but they come with quite a few different items. My favorite would definitely be the travel set. That's one item I'm definitely adding to my shopping cart today, but they also have a lunchbox set here as well. But it seems like the most popular accessory set here is the hair care set. Compared to the dolls that I showed earlier, these dolls don't come with any accessories, they just come with an outfit and the doll itself, and they don't have any names, it's just based on their hobbies, so there's a ballerina doll, a vlogger doll, and a class president doll too. What's interesting about the outfits that are sold here is that they're styled a lot like a regular clothing store, so the outfits are in hangers and you go through the different rows and you choose an outfit that you're looking for, so there's PJs, there's also a fancy outfit, and even casual and sportwear too. And I noticed that a lot of the shoes were sold separately in plastic packs. Packaging. This doll is different from some of the others because it is a Jojo Siwa doll, so she's wearing her classic outfit and the bow as well. This item is a remote control balancing board. It's styled a lot like a hoverboard, but it's so interesting that it works with the remote control. This item is so great for styling rooms. It comes with three different color options, white, pink, and purple. And right above that, there are a few room setup options too. There's also an art set, which I'm definitely adding to my cart today. It looks so realistic and it comes with so many different items too. So now it's time to move right along to the next door. 
I'm at Costco right now and I just found the American Girl section and it's so interesting because they have these gift boxes here and they're such great starter sets because you get the doll, the outfit, the accessory, and a book as well. I really love how each doll has a different storyline, so Luciana's interested in STEM, Gabby loves to dance, and Tenny is very involved in music. If you're looking to purchase an American Girl doll for someone who has never owned a doll before, I definitely recommend looking into these starter sets, but you do need to purchase an American Girl hairbrush since that doesn't come with it. Or even if you're looking to purchase an accessory set and they already have a few dolls, this item here is another really great option. It's perfect for back to school. It comes with an outfit, a school desk, a backpack, and some school accessories too. There are also some Welly Wisher accessory sets, and this one is themed around the holiday season. There's an outfit, there are some cookies, and even some candy canes. There is also a Welly Wisher starter set that is very similar to the American Girl one where it comes with the doll, an outfit, and a few accessories as well. This one is themed to a slumber party, so it comes with a PJs and sleeping bag, and there's a variety of different dolls available, but the accessories are all the same. Costco is definitely a really great place to visit, but it is now lunchtime. Lunch has just arrived and it looks so delicious. They had a lunch special here where you could have a main meal, a drink, and a garden salad as well, so I ended up ordering pasta and iced tea. And for dessert, I am actually at the Cheesecake Factory and the cheesecakes have just arrived and they look amazing and I can't wait to try them. The cheesecake was delicious, but right now I am at Target and I'm just taking a look at some more doll stuff. So here we have a few Our Generation items. There are some doll outfit sets here and it seems like a lot of the items are on sale, so I'll definitely have to take a look at those. And right next to the outfits, they have quite a few different accessory sets. So this one is all themed to running. They have a doll carrier set. This one is all themed to science, and that seems like it comes with a lot of smaller accessories. This item here is a styling head. It's really great to try out different hairstyles. One item that I've had on my wish list for a while is this bathtub, but I won't be able to bring it home with me just because it's a larger set, and I won't be able to fit it in my suitcase. One of the most popular our generation sets would definitely have to be the school set. It's right over here. It sets up as a school, and it comes with so different back to school themed accessories too. These sets are called deluxe outfits because they come with a few smaller accessories along with the outfit itself. It's so interesting to take a look at all of the different options they have. Right below the outfits they have a few horse sets available, a pet grooming set, and this item is one of the newer sets that I've noticed. It is the OG Cinema so it comes with quite a few different accessories, perfect for a movie night. The set is also on sale as well which is also really great but right next to that there are a few more of the larger sets including a food truck and a camper van. One of my favorite sets from our generation would definitely have to be the bunk bed. It looks really nice room setups, except it is made out of plastic, so it does break quite easily. There are also a few accessory packs here. My favorite set is the breakfast set. It comes with a small clock and some breakfast themed items. So here we have a few more. This one is a swim theme set. There's also a science lab set, and then there are a few different accessory packs. Some of them are more accessories, but some of them are accessories to outfits like shoes. And right next to the accessories, there are a few different dolls available, and they're actually on sale. They're $5 off. And I will be visiting one more store before I finish my shopping day, and it will be the American Girl Store. And I've just arrived at American Girl, so let's head inside to see what doll setups they have and what items are available. I've just entered into the store and they have so many different accessory setups. So right at the front they have the bowling alley, they have the game night table, and a dining table too. Right next to that display they have a small section themed to camping. We have the Camp American Girl set. There's also a lot of outdoor themed accessories and it's definitely perfect for the summertime. The lobby is split into two different sides, the historical section and the Truly Me section. Right now I'm taking a look at the Truly Me dolls and they have them all in a display case. It's really great to have them all shown so you're able to decide which one you want to purchase today. This section of the store has some of the holiday PJs, there's also a bunk bed as well. You can have a matching outfit, there's also a child version and a doll version too, so it's really great how everyone can be matching. And there's a display over here showing the three different outfits available. Over in the historical section, there's a display of all of the different historical characters available, and then over on the side, there's Blair and Luciana. There are also a lot of different setups for the historical characters as well. So this setup is for Mary Ellen and it's her seaside diner. We have all of her different food items displayed throughout the set. American Girl stores also have exclusive items for particular stores. So this shirt over here is themed to the Dallas store and it's the only place you can purchase it. There's a matching girl and doll shirt. Also in the downstairs section, there's a Welly Wisher area and a Bitty Baby area. There are some really lovely displays and it just gives an overview of what's available in the collection. Upstairs is a lot smaller. They have the bistro, so that's where you can go and dine. They also have the hair salon too, but they do have a few smaller displays of some of the Truly Me items as well. 
The hair salon is over to the corner of the store and they have a long bench sitting at the front with different hair salon chairs so you can see the doll's hair getting styled. Right next to the salon, there are a few different hair products that are available too. The most important item when purchasing a doll is definitely the hairbrush because you don't want to damage their hair. At the bistro, there are birthday packages available. So this one is the deluxe birthday celebration. It gives an overview of what's in the set. This one is themed around the Welly Wisher dolls and there's also a few accessories for the dolls too. And finally, this one is for the Bitty Babies. The last set is called birthday celebration and that's for someone who's celebrating a birthday and having a birthday party at the store. Unfortunately, it is now time to leave the American Girl store, but I had such a wonderful shopping day visiting all of the different stores to see what's available. I didn't end up managing to purchase too many items, but I got these two sets because they were on sale. They're both PJs. This one is themed to a unicorn. It comes with a lovely unicorn plush, and this one is themed to a dog. I just thought this one was so lovely, and the dog plush is so adorable too. So thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I really hope you guys enjoyed it.